My girlfriend called, asked if I could pick up her screen door and give it a quick paint job for a party she was getting ready to have. So I brought it home, cleaned it up. This is after it was cleaned up, having a look at what I need to do. I know I need to sand off some of the loose paint. Just the general get ready to throw some paint at it. As she calls it, putting lipstick on a pig. That's my handy dandy little Black & Decker palm sander. My husband picked it up for me at Walmart. Does a great job for the stuff I do. Sanded this whole screen door front and back. Just trying to get most of the loose paint off any dirt that might have been crusted on it. Uh, you know, getting it ready to accept paint and hopefully hold. I ended up having to put a piece of wood on the one side. It was a little shy of being wide enough for her spot. I'm not very happy with how it turned out, but she didn't care. It serves its purpose. Almost all sanded, front and back. And now for paint. My biggest obstacle for this job was to not get paint on the screens or at least not as much paint on the screens as the person who painted it before me did. I think I managed it pretty well. Sometimes just given something that's old and dirty like this, a paint job, doesn't matter how much paint you get on anything else, it just looks so much better, much brighter and cleaner. When I went to hang it up at her house, she had a, a little, I don't even know what it was. We made a wreath out of it, just pulled some fall flow it, foliage out of something else she had. It was a few years old and threw it all together. You'll see that at the end of this little job for her. It's adorable. I got a thing for owls this year. It has an owl on it. already looking so much brighter just the one coat I ended up putting two on it all just to make sure she didn't care how old and worn out it looked she really wanted the farmhouse look and that's usually a screen door showing a lot of love Here we are, all painted. You can see the edge, that the little thin piece of board on the right that I had to attach. Here is where the door is going to go in her garage. And ta-da! We have it hung up. It worked, but we had to trim a little off the corner to close properly. I'll probably go back work on a little more. Here's that little wreath with the little owl in the corner. I think it's so cute. Hi there. Uh, so you just got to see me do my girlfriend's screen door. So it kind of was a quick movie, quick video. So I thought, well, I have to paint my front door and we're buying a new keyless touchpad door handle and deadbolt system for it. So let's just add that to her little video. Okay, hope you enjoy it. See you soon. Here's my front door area. Quick look at the living room, dining room. 
the door needed a paint job. A lot of the paint was peeling off. I put a little shelf next to the entryway to decorate. And then I had to paint it. I have that brown paper hanging in the middle because the light was so blinding I couldn't see to trim out around the window. Just black, plain black. Looks so much sharper and cleaner. Like the lines are more defined. I really like it with the little shelf next to it. It's a great place to throw your keys or any little thing you don't want to forget as you walk out. Very happy with this door handle. This is inside and this is outside. Thanks for watching.